so a while ago we bought this vintage greenhouse doll's house. Well, you bought it as a present, didn't you? I did. I bought it as a present for you. Yes, no, on and eBay. You forgot about it. Yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> just in a box <laughs> and then you went oh look yeah. <laughs> and then we were also sent a wonderful box of miniature gardening miniatures <laughs> from a lovely subscriber named Carrie Byer so today is the day that we're gonna put them together yeah and combine them and make our little miniature greenhouse next to our big greenhouse yes we were inspired because our big greenhouse is in disarray so at the end of the film we are also going to sort out our big greenhouse yeah. so we hope you enjoy also this film is made at our allotment yes <laughs> and i'm sorry about some of the sick plants that are there <laughs> <laughs> so we hope you enjoy and let's see how this goes nice at the back. I was going to wax it because it won't be to move it. <laughs> and I might put some wax on it too. so cute. You can already tell I'm going to really like this. <laughs> Still not sure there's going to be enough plants, but well, we're going to supplement some with some fresh flowers from the allotment for now. That's an actual old one. Some seedlings. It was just piled now. back as I can. <laughs> wow, they look cute. Mm -hmm. well, you should have a lot of piles of pots too. Yeah, oh yeah, underneath mm -hmm. definitely. And the top, we're going to have a little um, potting station. Mm -hmm. I need real dirt for that. Mm -hmm. Thank you. 
Oh, actually, I need to wax it into position sometimes. Do you think that's the best place? For oh, maybe I should. Oh. <laughs> Shall I wax them in first, or I suppose you should? Oh, well, I don't know. <laughs> maybe I'll put all the wax on them, and then we can arrange them. Mm -hmm. One. I might put in the 1920 stalls house. Mm -hmm. um, shall I hang this up? Where would this go? Would that go at the back again? Maybe sort of in the front. Oh, okay, yeah. <coughs> but on the outside, on the inside, I mean. Yeah, yeah. yeah. By the door? Maybe. Or inside? Maybe inside. Like that? Maybe on the other side. Maybe we should make the other bits first, like the, the thingy station and then put the plants okay. around it. Sure. Where's the tray? Here's the tray. Ooh, luckily, there's some just there. You could use the tidy trail. <laughs> The bean bees. An angle? Yeah. Oh my goodness. That looks so cute. Need a couple of piles of oh, pots, I'd say, pots. on this side. They might be too big, might they? Oh, little pots. Maybe. I oh, know. <laughs> it's so sticky. Oh, that one's stuck in it anyway. What, like here? Yeah, there's something needs to be or in this back. corner too, yeah. Yeah. Some more? More? Yeah, maybe just one brown one. Okay. Oh, I can't see. <laughs> I can't really see either. <laughs> Oh no, the seeds were in this. Oh, okay. Wow, fiddly. <laughs> yes. Ooh. Don't have to put all of them in there, they can be seeds elsewhere. Oh, oh. <laughs> my hands are all sticky from wax now. <laughs> put them in, they come out. only just occurred to me that we are doing this and there are other people here. <laughs> I wonder what they must think. We haven't put dragon on yet and here we are making a tiny greenhouse. <laughs> I'll leave some seeds around. Same colour as our real water. 
obviously has to have a watering can next to the seat. It's <laughs> really cute. It's probably uh, put some of the big pots into these. Mm -hmm. Maybe on the corner, we need to fill up the space. <laughs> we put a mm -hmm. trap on it. Which is the best? Which is the prettiest? This one? Yes. Thank that you. there. Yes. <laughs> I'm just going to quickly, before we do this, go and collect a couple of flowers from around the allotment to pop in some of the spare pots. a lot of this weed oh. <laughs> you get the gist we'll have to do it probably actually put a couple more in that one these are everywhere we leave them growing along the paths for the pollinators oh Do that off camera. Obviously these might last too long but they'll look very cute for the start. These adorable, again, more weeds, adorable little delicate blue flowers. Kind of look like forget-me-nots but they're not. We do have some forget-me-nots growing but they won't be out flowering until next year. Yarrow, which again we let grow all along the path because it's very beneficial. Oh, <laughs> and there may be a borage flower, but not the one that our friend is enjoying. <laughs> We've got lots of these, so. And aren't they just beautiful little star-shaped flowers? Oh, a tom a one of our tomatoes that just came up is going red. How exciting. He's really getting in there for a drink. For some food. Look how cute these are. Oh, they're adorable. <laughs> Let's put them all by the front, though. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll stick these ones at the front. 
Yeah. Forget-me-nots are they? Is that what they are? Yeah. Oh, I said they look like forget-me-nots, but they were too small. Yeah, they look adorable, don't they? bug spray. <laughs>
Yeah, it's a bit overgrown. I need to sort it out. Yes, I need to need to uh, sort them out. Yeah, they've they've fallen over. I need to sort them out. I didn't trim them enough. Now I can't. There's too many tomatoes. <laughs> I need to get in there and sort it out with my new cane. The plants are doing very well. They're just um, <laughs> a bit overgrown. Do you need help? <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh no! Okay, okay, I'm gonna have to stop filming. Well, that is a lot more manageable. Still incredibly overgrown, but getting tons of tomatoes and tons of cucumbers. Almost too many cucumbers. Wow! <laughs> Good beetroot. They could be bigger, but mum is allergic to raw beetroot, yeah. <laughs> so we have to pickle it. So we don't, we don't need too much of it. Didn't know until we started, until we grew. Yeah, I grew a little bit, uh, ate a little, tiny bit, and it, yeah, it <laughs> made my throat really sore. <laughs> wow, this one looks bigger though. I read that you push root vegetables down first and then pull them out. Oh, that one's pretty good. Yeah, that's a pretty. We could cook those pretty, ones. Yeah, they you know. Oh, we could always add to them to our courgette soup to make it a bit cooked, less red. green. Yeah, make it sort of brown then. I imagine. Mhm. Mm brown soup's good. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Feeling pretty good about those. That one. I reckon that one can stay in there for a bit. Do you not think? I don't know. Put your finger around. Maybe. I don't know, I don't want to get too woody. Okay. I mean, we do have a lot, don't we? Oh, there's some hot vine weed hanging behind it. This is a neat tea, isn't it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Tiny little one. That's a pickly one. Yeah. You know, we can start the pickles. We don't, until, mm -hmm. you know, we can start making it and then just fill it up. You see what I mean? Mm hmm. I think we'll need that one. Yeah. I think that one's really quiet, yeah. So I've got my bigger radishes growing into bigger radishes, but I might pick all these little purple ones to add to the soup. Mm -hmm. Because they're only... Oh, look! How beautiful they are. And I, yeah, I only want little ones. That one might be a bit too little. Oh, <laughs> that one's not so little. I was not expecting that. Could float yeah, them on why? the top. Why sat down? Why they were planted at the exact same time? I don't know. It's weird, isn't it? Light and things. This this tent was supposed to protect <laughs> them from flea beetles. It's not really worked. No, it hasn't. And then weirdly, I think the one in the middle might be just a little bit too small yet. So you're keeping your big ones then? Well, yeah. These are the big. These aren't quite daikon ones, but they're big. Big white moony, mooly, so they're supposed to get a bit bigger. It's a bit behind me, don't you see it? Sneaky. Um, and yeah, these are long ones that have, yeah, they've got a lot more to, to grow. Cool. But maybe I should chuck a couple more in the 
Where I've just taken these ones out. Yeah. So it's so, oh, so pretty. Oh, you love radishes. Don't I you? do. Look at that. Yeah, snails or slugs been eating it a bit. It's a lot of powdery mildew on my yeah. courgettes, but they're still producing, so. The sweet corn. Yes. Look at the sweet corn. It's the first time we've ever grown sweet corn, and look, look at the crazy alien hair. This is the castle. I think there's another one coming next to it. Yeah. Oh, they are beautiful. Look at the crazy hair. <laughs> yeah, the castle. Mm -hmm. And our zinnias, we took our zinnias off, and now they're. Go mad. Look at what's on the zinnia. Oh. What is that? Is it a grasshopper? It looks like a grasshopper. But a tiny one. Cricket? Very long antennae. What are you doing all the way up there? Wow. Where are you going to fit a cabbage? I don't know, they don't mind shade. Um, I just want, it's just an experiment, it's just one cabbage left, so you can see you can come here. <laughs> just to see if these other plants are a deterrent. So did that, oh, so yeah. did the tomato next to him. And now look at the size of the tomatoes coming on it. He needs a steak. Yeah, he can. And it's stopped flowering now, so. My potatoes have early blight. <laughs> Before anyone says, oh, they look a bit rough. <laughs> So we hope you enjoyed that. I think it looked really cute in the end. It did, and yeah. And yeah, thank you as always for everyone that likes, comments and subscribes. It's free to do if you enjoy the videos. There's a button down below. We reached 15,000. We did, thank you so, so much. That is so we're exciting. We're at 15 and a half now. Oh. It happened really quickly. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got, as always, some very exciting big projects coming up and we're going to do them. Uh -huh. We're going to power through and do them. <laughs> So keep an eye out for those. We've got um, to finish the 1920s dolls house. We do, yes. <laughs> so, yeah. Have a wonderful week and we will see you soon. Bye. Bye.